What's up guys, how's it going? Mike the Tech here. And today I'm gonna to show you how to set up um, family sharing in Steam so that you can authorize different devices within your home or even outside your home and uh, allow up to five different people to share your games and content. Um, before we get started, I wanna give a quick shout out to Ms. Kick 2 s Todd M, and Rob Leslie. Thank you so much for your support. If you wanna become a channel supporter, click on that join button below, get access to my stream archives, emoticons, and shout outs and videos like this. So let's go ahead and get started with the tutorial. Um, in order to set up Steam Family Sharing, you have to go into your settings. So go to Steam and go into Settings. And click on Family on the left side. And you're gonna to have to go to Manage Family View. Here is where you're gonna set up who can see what content on your computer. So let's go ahead and say, I wanna share all games and um, online content and features from the Steam store. And I don't want necessarily anyone, even if they're my friends, to be able to have access to this specifically, unless it's set up in my privacy settings. So I'll just allow my games to be shared. All right, we'll set up my recovery email address. We'll set up a pin. And a secret code. So let's go ahead and open up the email. And we will enter that secret code. All right. So now Family View is enabled, and um, on this top right, it'll tell us when Family View is enabled and when it's not, um, and we can enable or switch that at any time. And um, this will allow others to be able to access your content. So if I go ahead and enable Family View, you'll see that that turns on. Um, now let's go ahead and go into our settings again. Let's turn this off first. and go into settings. All right. And um, in order to authorize devices to use Steam Family Sharing and eventually add accounts to it, you have to actually authorize the devices you plan to allow onto it. So um, you have to log into that computer or phone and click on authorize sharing on this computer. All right. And now it is authorized. And it says you can authorize up to 10 computers. All right. So now any of your friends or family can log on to that computer or device and they'll see your games in their uh, Steam library. It'll show as, in my case, Mike's games. And when they see your games, they can right click and request to be able to play them. And you can authorize them as a user so they could just play them whenever they want. Um, and that's essentially how it works. You can only share with five different accounts and on 10 devices. So for example, if it's you and your brother and sister and your mom and your dad, that's five people. And if each of you have a phone and a computer or a computer and a laptop or whatever the case, you can authorize on essentially all of your devices so anyone can play on any of the devices. And that's essentially what it's meant for. Um, if you have any questions about how to set this up or um, if you run into any issues with the steps for pairing, let me know and I'll try to I'll try my best to answer them in the comment section below. Uh, thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Peace. What? You've never heard of stream savers and you thought PewDiePie was the only YouTuber to make a game? <laughs> I made a game too, and it's called Stream Savers, and it's available for pre-order right now for $9.99, and that's a great price!